We begin with a local breaking news alert right now. Police are investigating a bank robbery in Cheviot. Someone held up the Fifth Third Bank on Harrison Avenue this morning, but police believe the suspect is in the Westwood area. Local 12's Adam Clements is live there with the latest. Adam. Well, good afternoon, Sheila. The scene was cleared here just moments ago. Uh, right now, we're on Holland Grove, which is just off of Harrison Avenue. Police were here for a couple of hours trying to track down that suspect. This is also where police were able to track the vehicle they say he was driving at the time of the robbery. They say he ditched it here at the end of the street after running from them when they initially tried to pull him over. They say he took off from the vehicle on foot, showed a handgun, now, the car is a Nissan Altima with dealership tags. It was towed away just a short time ago. Now, just about two blocks over on Bracken Woods, there was also a pretty heavy police presence earlier. That's where police tell us they found at least some of the money that was taken in the robbery. Now, the reason they were able to track the money is because the bag from the bank had a GPS tracking unit inside it. So this guy really didn't get very far from the corner of Harrison and Glenmore where the robbery occurred. Police tell us the suspect is in his 20s. He's got light skin, a scruffy beard, and he's wearing dark jeans and a dark shirt. Police want residents in the area to be on the lookout. What we do ask residents is you know your neighborhood's better than anybody. If you see someone that doesn't belong in your neighborhood or is acting suspicious in your neighborhood or a car comes and is waiting for somebody, you can either call 911, you can call Crime Stoppers, you can call the, uh, anybody that you want. All we're asking is that for your health, you know your neighborhood's better than we do. And if there's somebody here that doesn't belong that you think may be involved in this call. Fifth Third Bank that was robbed right now. We, uh, we do know that no one was harmed inside. The bank is closed. And right now, no information is being released on how much money was taken. Reporting live in Westwood, Adam Clements, Local 12 News. Sheila, back to you. Thanks a lot, Adam.